CCFC Sharks are taking on Houston FC Dynamo this weekend in the season opener. Please welcome coach Manuel Iwabuchi joining us again. And then we have the team captain Renzo Bosso joining us from Santiago, Chile. Uh, captain, I want to talk to you first. If you could, what's the competition like here in town and all over the state when it comes to playing proper football? Uh, it's definitely a uh, high level competition. You have yes. all players from all over the world coming to the US, especially for, for college soccer. So um, the level is high. The level is high. The competition is high. So we need to make sure to be prepared for it. And coach, how do you prepare them for uh, the matchups? Is there like, do you get to study the competition, see how they play and know where you need to strengthen your team and get them stronger in certain areas of the field? Uh, yes, sir. Absolutely. It's it's a process of a lot of preparation uh, for us. Just style of play wise, we we like to be concerned with how we're playing, uh, how well that we're clicking on the field, our rhythm. Um, but overall, it's it's just that it's building the chemistry, it's building the style of play, and making sure that that we're doing our part in making the preparations um, in the right way. And, and coach, if you could explain a little bit about these players, uh, we know they're from all over the place, but uh, do they have jobs here in town and then this is what they really want to do in life? Are they some of them students? How does that work? Uh, yes, sir. So these players we've uh, recruited through a process of, of months to bring down the corpus for a specific reason, which is uh, try to help us win the first division title in club history. Um, but all of them are basically college students or finishing up college with ambitions to go professional. So USL2 is basically a springboard league that allows these players to showcase their talents in a competitive league over the summer, hopefully win division titles, win a national title, and hopefully put themselves in the spotlight to go pro in the future. I was going to say, like, you, you couldn't have said it better, putting themselves in the spotlight and a chance to kind of showcase their skill set. Uh, Captain Renzo, I'm going to leave the last question with you. If you could, uh, what would you like to see from fans? What's the showing? like on a typical game and what can we do to really get out there and support you? I mean, I really think last year we had a, a really good show in and during the games. Uh, we had a lot of people come to, to watch the games and I'm like, what I expect is just people to come, be uh, support, be be part of the family because we really have a strong family here in Corpus and, and yeah, be loud because that helps us win games and, and we want to win the title. So that's what we need. Well, gentlemen, we wish you nothing but the best. I think the team behind you is messing with y'all because they kicked the ball in your direction. I don't know if they're trying to beam you in the back of the head, but watch out for those guys. Good luck this weekend. We have the information we're going to put up on the screen right now. It is taking place at Cabinet's Field uh, tomorrow at 7. So get out there and support CCFC as they take on the Houston FC Dynamo.